You mentioned someone on Hoth was sending the Empire information about you. Have you discovered who it was? I think it was someone on board. Since I found that monitoring device, I've been watching our communications. I spotted a message to the Empire in amongst other messages while the channels were busy, but I can't trace who sent it. The monitoring device? The messages? Lord Kairos's inside knowledge? Our traitor can work our communication system. I can't stake out the comm system and hope to catch them in the act. Perhaps not, but if we knew who used the system the most, that would be a start. Alani! She's always getting news from her world. No, no. Alani sticks to her personal channel. Ty only got a call or two before he left. Duan never speaks to anyone. It's cloaked in mystery. You know, Blasis gets an awful lot of work from the Aragorn bureaucracy, and a lot of calls. Wait, when you were on Hoth, and someone leaked those messages, Blasis was sending reports everywhere. What if he alerted the Empire, then? Even if Blasis isn't responsible, he could point us in the right direction. Wait here. I'll see where he's got to. No, it couldn't be Blasis. I just sent him on a mission. I meant to surprise you, Nadia. King Sethan and Queen Niska themselves are donating a regiment to the Republic. This king and queen are your homeworld's rulers? Yes, yes, that's right. The royal family wanted to heal relations between the Rift Alliance and the Republic. They thought donating troops would help. They planned a ceremony on Waypoint Station 3 to present you with the soldiers. But you were needed on Hoth. So I sent Blasis as our envoy. He's with the King and Queen right now. Put me through to Blasis at once. There's no answer. Jedi, what have I done? I'll contact Ty. His droids could guard the royal family until we get there. Be sure he knows our suspicions, just in case. Will do, Jedi. Let's go. All fixed. It just isn't your day. And here's our guest of honor. Kairos, if the Jedi takes one step toward their majesties, cut their throats. It will be done, my master. We're no threat to you. Please, at least release my wife. I know you can exploit any advantage, Jedi. So the soldiers had to die. The civilians, too. I do, after all, take pride in being thorough. So much darkness, and I never felt anything from you except fear. Is that curiosity or envy? I'm no mere infiltrator. I am Organ Blasis, and I am a child of the Emperor. I was brought before the Emperor as an infant, and imprinted with his power, his consciousness. I shared the greatest mind in the galaxy. With the first sun conceiving my presence, I joined hundreds of my brothers and sisters scattered throughout the Republic to watch and wait. 
Who is this first son you speak of? Supreme among those to receive this honor. I can't even comprehend the power he wields. This is immaterial. An imperial fleet is coming. You will all be destroyed. And without the Rift Alliance, the Republic is finished. But the Empire is merciful, Your Highness. Your planet could be spared the coming destruction. How? Tell me. Order your bodyguards to kill the Jedi. All resistance to evil begins with saying no. Senator Grell told us about your courage. I will not raise my hand against you. Your Empire's friendship is worthless to us. You'll regret being so stubborn when your planet is burning. Kairos, show them how a Jedi dies. Trivial. Your day. Why won't you accept that our victory is inevitable? Destroying my servant won't end this. In that case, killing you might be more productive. First son of the Emperor will lead us to glory. Your death is the first step on that path. Not if I have anything to say about it. It has been agony restraining myself from killing you. He's dead? You... How could you... He seemed invincible. Why would he do this? Tobus Grell said Blasis was your ally. I intend to find out before these children of the Emperor do any more damage. Our troops died because of his treachery. They were so proud. They would have served your Republic well. Your soldiers died nobly, trying to protect you. I hope Tobus Grell and little Nadia are all right. We owe them so much. Senator Grell and his daughter have earned their place on my ship. I'll take care of them. We will ask the Republic for help getting home. I will never forget how you came to our rescue. From now on, the Republic will have full access to our treasury. That would more than suffice. Goodbye, Jedi. Go safely. Merely a scratch. Master, I've marked the best escape pod for your sole use. I, of course, will go down with the ship. Blasis was a Sith. He's dead, and the royal family are safe. But their soldiers weren't as lucky. Jedi, quickly. You need to hear this. Good to see you. 
My commanders and our droids routed an Imperial fleet near your position, but this report is odd. Our men had a dozen sudden power failures, a major communications fault. I'd call that sabotage. Stay alert, and let me know if there's any more incidents. I sense a Jedi business explanation approaching. Master Seo's trying to get through. Thank the Force you're all right. The Empire has launched a devastating offensive. The galaxy is again at war. Dozens of major systems are being invaded. An Imperial ambush almost broke the Republic fleet and the Jedi. Every hour more are lost. We managed to protect the core worlds, but the rest of the Republic is under fire. The Empire never intended this peace to last. I need you. All of you. The Rift Alliance worlds are the only ones still standing strong. We need you to... Wait. I don't see the Aragorn representative. Is Blazus all right? Blazus turned on me and had to be destroyed. The children of the Emperor. Now, of all times, you say they've hidden themselves in the Republic. This first son is able to completely mask the other children from us. Hmm. That fills a void in our knowledge. Several years ago, one of the Dark Council turned and joined us. He brought valuable intelligence. He mentioned these children of the Emperor. But even the Dark Council only knew terrible rumors. We must be on guard. In the meantime, the Chancellor has invoked an ancient law giving Jedi Masters military authority. The Republic needs our leadership. The children are the greater threat. If I catch their leader, I can unmask them. I agree, but without a way to detect these children, we must face the Empire. We can't win with the armies we have. The Republic needs powerful allies. And you have already proven you could lead them. You and the Rift Alliance must search the galaxy, seek out the strongest forces you can find, to strike back at the Empire. You won't be alone out there, Jedi. Balmora will always be your ally, no matter what. I'd rather follow someone I respect. Count me in, too. We've come a long way together. Now it's time to use our strength. We must begin our search for allies at once. I must admit, this task does seem near impossible. Places murdered so many of my people alone. To fight all the children and this empire. Who could help us? We need more than just soldiers. To truly face the Empire, we'll need superior tactics or technology. What of the Noeticons? The ancient masters who taught you the shielding technique. Their knowledge and experience could guide us. The Noeticons were lost when the Sith attacked me on Coruscant. We recovered the last fragments of the Noeticons, and our most gifted engineers have been reconstructing them on Tython. They haven't responded to anyone, even the Council. But they may remember you. I must go. Leave for Tython and speak to the Noeticons. I hope their knowledge has survived. May the Force be with you. Do you recognize me? Broken vessel barely frees its contents. Your face is familiar. Though life has written on you since we taught you the shielding technique. Yes. Now I recall. 
I sense the Sith were behind our sudden plunge into darkness. A moment, Master Arca. Was the shielding technique successful? Did it save your master? Yuan Par is alive and well because of the lessons you taught me. That is most excellent news. Now, tell us what brought you here. So, you seek an army to protect the Republic from its enemies. Quite a puzzle, even for us. But not impossible, Master Tharis. The ancient Rakata boast in their writings of imprisoning a sleeping army. As I remember, the Rakata conquered and enslaved most of the galaxy before they died out. The translation? Oh, this is fascinating. Apparently, the Rakata imprisoned this army in stasis beneath the planet's surface. But see, the writings are incomplete. There's no record of which planet it is. Perhaps we could extrapolate the planet's position from the rest of the writings. They speak of a fading nova in the night sky during the prison's construction. In that time period? Then it's somewhere in the mid-rim. But we're missing a coordinate to pinpoint it. See here, a monument proclaims our victory. And that's the Rakata term for Hoth. This monument on Hoth will have the last coordinate. But go carefully. The Rakata protected their monuments from enemies and rebelling slaves. Its guardians may still be active. I feel like there's so much more you could teach me. You've done a great service in reawakening us. For now we must conserve our energy. And you have an army to find. May the Force be with you, and with the Republic. Yes, make your day for first, young Tedro Gise. You're mistaken, hologram. I belong to the Jedi Order. Sekian, Actes de Vertine. Zinesti Hedruli, das Bruli Fehed and Dunkwa. You have my attention. There's Matzenke, you Joan. Maestra me hiruba. We been fucked up me feel tough now my cape. Me bag address past yaktan el bines for costing tea. There's Matzenke, you Joan. Maestra me hiruba. That's absolutely terrible. The Eshka sound like trouble. With a little guidance, perhaps trouble for the Empire?
Me banda dress past the actan albin as for costing tea. You're planning to brainwash people? The Gorherba, Jehinsatsias Netu. I'm afraid I can't let you harm innocent people. Rage oak what avis as eek anor cool hoge ege. But my Senate clearance got us some answers. It's a world called Belsavis. And the Ashka won't be lonely. The Republic's using Belsavis as a high security prison. I wonder if those prisoners realize there's an entire army under their feet. <laughs> If the Eshkar rebel, they'll just go back in their box. But if they don't, the Republic gets powerful new shock troops. We should seek out these Eshkar with all haste. I think they've been imprisoned long enough. <laughs> 